Hi, this is Trace HD, and I want to thank you for joining me today for another weekly Oracle and Tarot card reading. And today's reading will cover us for the week of January 27th through February 2nd. And we're going to be using the Archangel Power Tarot cards by Doreen Virtue. Okay, and if you'd like to see this entire deck, you can do so by checking out my playlist here on my YouTube channel. I have, I believe, about 300 decks worth of card deck reviews, unboxings, whatever you want to call them. Uh, so check it out. Okay, so we could use this as a pick a card reading where you pick card one, two, or three, or it could be a weekly reading where all three cards are blended into the week. So let's get started. As I shuffle the deck, I'm asking all light beings, angels, and God, please relay the message I need to share with my viewers the highest good of all. At the beginning of the week, I'll take a card from the top. We have number 21, the worlds. Okay, in the middle of the week, a card number two. I'll take one from the center. We have Page of Raphael. Okay, and then card number three will be the bottom of eight of Gabriel. Okay, so let's get started here. We have the first card is the worlds. Archangel Michael, a very happy ending, coming full circle, spiritual growth and insight. So it's possible something is going to be ending. Okay. It may be something that you can't wait for it to be done. You can't wait for it to be out of your life. Or it might be something that just isn't meant to be. Kind of a little sad, a little bittersweet. Whatever it is, you're completing a cycle. And what I get from spirit here is you're going to be happy with whatever this is. You might not feel that way um, right now at the time. Uh, but you're going to understand why it happened. It's going to provide you spiritual growth and insight. And whenever we go through these things, we gain wisdom, okay? We become a stronger person. Um, it's a, a beautiful, beautiful card to start the week out. So whatever's coming full circle, whatever cycle you're completing, okay, is going to end up being something positive for you. And then in the middle of the week, or for those of you that picked card number two, uh, Page of Raphael. And it says, gentle, loving, dreamy, open-hearted. A new emotional situation. Messages regarding relationships or social invitations. Great intuitive insights. So wonderful, wonderful. Something's ending, okay? But then something new is beginning. And you have to have endings in order to have beginnings and, and, and a new fresh start, okay? When something ends and leaves your life, it's making room for something better and, and happier to enter. And this is telling you that. This is confirming that, you know, whatever it is, um, you're going to get a message regarding a relationship, a social invitation. Maybe some of you out there will be asked out on a date. Maybe some will be invited to a party or a get-together. Um, but this is great, okay? It's going to be something good. Something ends. Something's going to begin. And then the third card, if you picked card number three, or the end of the week, is the Eight of Gabriel. Okay, and the card reads, a great deal of activity, sudden and immediate results, important communication. So it seems to me like there's some kind of a message coming in. Uh, the middle of the week was saying, uh, you know, messages regarding relationships or social invitations. And now this is sudden and immediate results with an important communication. So maybe you're going to uh, get a letter. Uh, maybe some of you are, are going to school. Maybe you're getting some type of certification. Maybe you're going to get uh, a, a letter saying that you were accepted, you know, maybe into a university or some course of study. OK, maybe this uh, important communication that you're getting, you know, is going to be from something that you've been working very, very hard on, something that you've achieved, maybe a certificate or some form of achievement. Um, maybe it could be legal documents, something you've been waiting, you know, to be settled for a while. Whatever it is, this week is going to have movement. That's for sure. It's not going to be stagnant. Whatever's ending in the beginning of the week Whatever cycle is completing itself, let it end. Let it go. Because when you let it go, 
You're allowing the new to come in. Something new wants to come in, something positive and exciting. And like I said, by the end of the week, you know, you're going to see some type of results for maybe something you've been working hard on, something you've been looking forward to. Wow, what a beautiful week. Uh, if you've enjoyed this reading, please like it by giving it a thumbs up, share it, and above all, subscribe because I'll be back with more.